update on uh, Project Nano. So um, Project Nano is on day 19 now. I started it on the first of the month and it is now the 19th. And just uh, gonna switch over the lights to the white light. So you guys can see what's going on. So again, this is the uh, Marine Space MC40, which is an eight gallon tank. I've got a pair of Ocelaris clowns in there, which are uh, doing very well. They seem to be very happy. They're eating very well. Um, I did take out all the um, Mexican turbo snails because they were disturbing um, the coral. So uh, they've um, been taken out. And uh, as you can see here, I've got another coral banded shrimp here, and it looked like he just molted. Because um, when I cleaned this tank up, I did not see the exoskeleton. So uh, he's just molted, and seems that the water is healthy. That's the second molt at least in this tank. Um, as you can see, I've got some GSP growing on a strand there, but it's not blooming very well because uh, it keeps getting knocked over by uh, different creatures. Uh, I've got a couple hundred crabs in here as well. Um, I've also got some zoas. Uh, they seem to be opening up very well. And I've got some other uh, GSP here. Again, uh, one of them gets banged into all the time. The other one has opened up a little bit here. And then the other strand has, has been pretty abused. There was a snail eating it the other day, so I don't think I'm gonna yield anything from that one. I think what I need is, um, and I do have an offer from a friend of mine uh, who has a uh, seven year um, old uh, established uh, coral tank. He's going to uh, let me frag off some stuff, so I, I think what I need is a bigger uh, piece of GSP to start off with, just to uh, get, get things going fast. As you can see, I do have a frag from another friend's tank. I'm not sure what kind of corals those are. Maybe you guys can um, post what you think they are. They seem to be getting along okay. And uh, I did put a pistol shrimp and a goby in here. I've not seen them since they went in. I've not seen any carcasses. I've not seen any um, bodies on, on the carpet. So I'm not sure exactly what happened to them. Um, but they're still MIA and it's been about maybe a week now, at least, maybe two weeks. And uh, one other thing I'd like to point out on this tank is that there is a massive amount of copepods that have showed up. I'm not sure if they showed up as a result of the live rock or if they came with that frag that I took out of my friend's tank, that frag on top, or if this is just a natural progression of the tank, but this is uh, day 19, so see copepods are very prevalent in this tank. As a matter of fact, they're more prevalent here than they are in Project Pico. So I'm thinking about maybe uh, using my turkey baster and moving some over um, to Project Pico. And um, they're actually all over this tank. Um, they're either, either, even in the, uh, the sump area. And by the way, my skimmer still hasn't showed up at the LFS. I've been checking in. Uh, it's been at least two weeks now, so I plan on going up there in person to see uh, if it's not sitting on a shelf somewhere or if the owner's seen it. Um, I've changed the filter um, floss. Well, I didn't change it. I actually just rinsed it out once. Uh, it does a very good job of uh, trapping food. And you can see that there are a few copepods on this side too. And I haven't really noticed any in the last um, area. Uh, I'm not sure if there's much in the way of uh, anything for them to eat here, so. Um, but yeah. So this tank's 
progressing uh, real well. Really like the progress that, that it's making. And, you know, my plan is to maybe get another mom bedside table and set the uh, second nano uh, up next to the other side of the bed there. Um, I believe dimension-wise, um, that tank will fit nicely uh, sideways on the bedside table, if I'm not mistaken. I'll have to take some measurements on it. Um, but this rimless tank was a steal, so... Um, and it's one of a kind because the manufacturer does not make this size anymore. Uh, it's 10.7 gallons. So look um, for updates on that shortly. Um, I'll be getting some raw materials maybe tomorrow to um, start on that project. And uh, we'll be moving some of the stuff out of this tank um, into that one as soon as it starts um, getting established. Also, um, with this hang on back... I'd like to maybe um, put a put a light up there to start growing some algae. Um, I really want to do like a refugium um, algae growth uh, filtration, uh, a natural filtration system instead of uh, a mechanical filter filtration, um, just to have something different. Um, so that's my goal of this one. So be on the lookout for that, and I'll have to um, come up with a project name for it as well. So anyway, that's uh, that's the update for Project Nano, uh, which is the Marine Space MC40. Thank you for watching my video.